Monday night here in Oakland was anything but a Merry Christmas Eve for the Broncos as they fall 27 to 14 to the Oakland Raiders. Denver falling to six and nine, ensuring that they will indeed suffer back to back losing seasons. It's going to be the first time the Broncos have suffered that dubious distinction since the 1971 1972 seasons. This game got off to kind of a weird start. A 99 yard punt return for a touchdown put the Raiders up seven nothing. Broncos thought they had downed the ball inside the one yard line. Heads up play by Dwayne Harris to pick it up and go down the sideline for the touchdown. Then from there, things just kept spiraling out of control for the Broncos. They trailed 17 nothing at halftime. Made it close or interesting, I should say, at least a couple times in the second half. Case Keenum found Deshaun Hamilton for a seven yard touchdown, and then he found Cortland Sutton for a 19 yard touchdown, but the Broncos never got within 10 in the second half. Keenum with two interceptions within the last six minutes of the game. Those ended up doing in the Broncos. They now fall to six and nine. As I mentioned, they will host the Los Angeles Chargers on Sunday afternoon at Mile High to close out the season. And we talked a lot coming into this game about how it might be the final game at the Oakland County Coliseum for the Raiders. Hard not to wonder if Sunday's game against the Chargers might be the final game as the Broncos head coach for Vance Joseph. In Oakland, I'm Michael Spencer for CBSDenver.com.